Hey guys, it's Noah here from iHollywood TV. Well, let's face it, family life can be a little hectic, but don't worry, we have lifestyle expert Yvette Rios with some of our top mom hacks to help us out this morning. Hello, Yvette, good morning. Good morning. It's so nice to have you here with us this AM. So we're gonna talk all about mom hacks. You're gonna be giving tips to all of our mom viewers watching this morning. So first off, let's start with how we can reduce screen time for the younger ones because it's great to allow our kids to get time on their tablets or in front of a TV screen. But what are some simple ways to really balance that out? Yeah, no, I'm so happy to be with you and I'm excited. I've partnered with some really great products that will be helpful. Awesome. And yes, I am a parent with two young kids. So finding ways to reduce screen time is so important to me. Mm -hmm. And that's why I'm loving this product called Tony's. So story time is a really special part of our day. It's my favorite part of the day. Yeah. Uh, but this makes that time even more engaging. The Tony Box is a screen-free audio speaker system. So you place these really cute little figures, they're called Tonys, they're like little action figures, on top of your speaker to play a song or a story. So they've got over 75 Tonys to choose from and each one plays a different story with lots of kid favorites like Peppa Pig, Paw Patrol, Wild Kratts, and more. And I love this, they've got these things called Creative Tonys. Mm -hmm. They're blank, so they come with no recording on them. And you can add your own voice reading a story by using their app. So imagine grandparents or loved ones not nearby recording a story in their voice for the kids. It is so oh, magical and it's such a meaningful way to connect. You know, Yvette, it always amazes me at the products they have for young kids. But now let's talk about safety at home. You know, a lot of parents, they're working from home. Some of the kids, they're still doing virtual learning instead of going to school in person. So here you have a better product for ensuring safety at home. Tell us more about that this morning. Yeah, for sure. You know, parents, you know, keeping your home safe should be our top priority. So this is a new product from Kida, and I love it because it's given me so much peace of mind. It's their smoke plus carbon monoxide alarm with smart features. Mm -hmm. So it's the first solution to add smart home control to your existing traditional KIDA hardwired and in interconnected alarm. So all you do is you replace one of your KIDA hardwired alarms with this unit and it connects all of your other traditional ones to the KIDA app. So through the app, you get real-time information on any potential issues, whether you're at home or you're away, and you can even use voice control through Alexa and Google Assistant. And this is so cool, you can add multiple households to the app that have this unit, so you can monitor your parents' or your grandparents' oh, homes nice. from the app too. Now, Yvette, to all the mothers that are watching this morning, what are some other easy solutions that you have that you can share with us this morning? Sure, you know, I've been really been trying this year in particular to just cut out some of the chemicals I use around my home. Mm -hmm. And this is a new um, recipe that I came across for a kind of an all-purpose general cleaner. It works really well and it's super simple. So it's a half cup white vinegar, a tablespoon of baking soda, a tablespoon of hydrogen peroxide, two cups of hot water, I add the juice of one lemon and some lemon oil. It smells great and it's terrific for cleaning countertops and furniture. It's sort of my go-to cleaner now. Um, and one last thing, I think for all the parents out there, I think it's really important for us to really keep those lines of communication open with our kids. Um, I used to always ask those super you know, silly questions when kids came home from school. I would ask them, how was your day? Yeah. And they would say, okay, or fine. And I just really <laughs> wouldn't get anywhere. So right. I've started asking my kids three questions at the dinner table. Um, I asked them what was the rose of their day, so what was the best part? What was the thorn of their day? What was the worst part? And what was the bud of their day? So what are they looking forward to? And you know, it's helped me just kind of get them talking a little bit more and getting a little bit more insight into how mm -hmm. um, their day went, which is really, really important. Well, Yvette Rios, thank you for the wonderful conversation. Real quick, where can we go for more information about everything that we have discussed? For sure, you can head on over to inthenews.tv. Well, there you have it right there. Yvette, you take care. You have a great day. You and you're always welcome back anytime on iHollywood TV. Thank you for a great conversation.
Thank you. Oh, that would be awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Have a good day. You too. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>